On breaking now, a man is dead in Grand Rapids after a shooting that happened around midnight. There was a large police presence and community members looking on hours after. 24 Hour News 8's Marvis Herring has been there talking with police and getting new information. Marvis. Teresa and Casey, good morning. We're still along Delaware Street Southeast and there's still a small emotional crowd where the victim was found this morning. Overnight, we did pull crime records that show this is the sixth homicide of the year in Grand Rapids. It's the first one, though, since back in January. Grand Rapids police telling me that the victim is a 28 year old man. He was found outside a home here in the 700 block of Delaware. That's between Eastern and Union on the southeast side of town. Let's talk about what police told me just over an hour ago around 12 30 this morning multiple people called them saying that they heard gunshots police rushed to the scene to find the victim who was suffering from multiple gunshot wounds the 28 year old died on the scene and a crowd it quickly formed as police searched for more evidence there's no suspect description right now and i did ask police about any threat to people who are living in this area we do not believe anyone is in danger. Um, all of our major case team detectives have left the area. The crowd has all left the area, so we don't believe that anyone in the, in the neighborhood tonight is in danger. Uh, we do believe that the victim was an intended target. Uh, it, like I get, again, like I said, this, we don't believe this is a random act. Police couldn't tell me if the victim lives in this area or not. They say they're still working to confirm the identity of the victim. We'll be working to get that information as soon as possible. Still a very emotional and evolving situation. We'll let you know what we find out. Live in Grand Rapids, Marvis Herring, 24 Hour News 8. Marvis. Good morning. We talked to Grand Rapids police who were here on the scene and they told us that the victim is a 28 year old man and this scene right now seems pretty calm. It's a lot different than it was just a few hours ago when there were police officers crime tape and at least 50 people here gathered around that crime tape all wanting answers. The shooting happened shortly before 1230 this morning. The 28 year old died on the scene and as the crowd continued to grow by the minute, police had to expand their perimeter while they investigated. Obviously, uh, the crowd's very emotionally charged. Um, there's maybe a loved one or a friend or relative that is now deceased. So the, the crowd's emotionally charged, uh, and, and you can imagine that that's going to be um, difficult to process. Police didn't have a suspect description when I asked about that. Obviously, the details of the shooting are still unfolding. It's still unclear what caused, what the motive of this shooting was. We're working to get those answers as well as the identity of the victim. We'll be sure to share that with you once we get it. Live in Grand Rapids, Marvis Herring, 24 Hour News 8. Marvis, thank you. If you're headed to downtown Grand Rapids, this 